this one out of the bag, I was like, oh no, 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 no. Um, but they're just, ow. But I really like it on. It felt like really autumn. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new, hello, hi, I'm Katie and welcome back if you're a returning subscriber. You're the best. If you are new to my channel and you enjoyed today's video, I'd love it if you could click that thumbs up button and that subscribe for all the good vibes. Join our Good Vibe Tribe by hitting the subscribe. So yes, today I'm bringing you a Lovies haul, so it's something you may not have heard of. It's somewhere I've seen lots of really pretty dresses from, but just never actually got around to ordering anything from there. So I'm very excited to be sharing it with you. Um, it's going to be my honest feedback of all of the products. And if you like anything, it will all be linked down below as well. Just because you guys always seem to ask, this top that I'm wearing is from Quiz and I have a Quiz haul next week. So make sure you are subscribed not to mess out on that one. Also, just for reference, I'm a UK size 12 and I'm five foot nine. Also, if you aren't following me over on Instagram, I'd love you can come and say hey. I'm at with love Katie, two underscores, and I share all things body positivity, self-love um fashion obviously and yeah just like everyday lifestyle genuine me being me doing my thing every single day yeah it's quite fun you should come join the good vibe tribe over there i just mentioned it was my first time ordering from lovies and one thing i will say is they didn't have any size chart reference on their website so i found it quite hard kind of like just guessing what size i would be so i ordered a few things in a medium but most things in a large so you'll, I'll mention when I've changed the sizes, but just assume everything's large unless I say otherwise. And yeah, I'm gonna share the prices with you of everything, how everything fit, and just how you can sell them all together. I'm gonna start with one of my favorite first pieces. So this one was 36 pound. And just a little tip as well, if you sign up for the email list, I'm sure you get like 10 or 20% off. Just a little tip for you there. Um, so this is a really cute, most of these are like quite ditzy print, quite girly, quite feminine. So if that's not your kind of style, you're probably on the wrong, um, <laughs> probably on the wrong channel but everything is that's my size like feminine girly chic hopefully things that will last in your wardrobe a while things aren't, that aren't going to go out of style so quite classic as well so i think this is just super cute pink is my favorite color and if you also love pink i do share a feature over on my instagram called on wednesdays we wear pink and i share loads of really cute pink outfits but yeah anyway let's get back to this so i got this in a large the only place it was a little bit big was on the bus and maybe if i popped a bra on that would have sorted that out but yeah, like I said, I'm a UK 12, so if you are slightly bigger busted, this will probably fit a size, up to a size 14, I would say. Um, it's got a zip at the side to get you in. It's got really cute little frilly sleeves with a little bow on. And then obviously this bit at the front, you can do up to the bust size. So it's really, really nice. It's really cute, just like easy summer dress, but also you could wear this in the night, I think. For like a nice date night with a little pair of barely bare heels, I think it's gonna look super cute. Maybe some nude ones, some white ones, um, and then like a little mini clutch. But I do think it is more of a day dress, but I think it could could be used for both, which is nice. Um, and I just wanted to mention these shoes. So I did, I don't know how much they are, I'll have to leave it down below. Um, but I wore these shoes or a very similar version of these shoes throughout the whole haul with every single outfit. So if you are looking for a staple pair of shoes, these are super cute. And the ones I had on are from my next, next week's quiz haul. So yeah, I either wore these or the quiz ones. If you are one of my wide fit girls, I would just say they, they aren't wide fit, the low these ones. And quiz do have wide fit, but the ones I have, they're not wide fit, unfortunately. So I probably would opt for the wide fit. <laughs> but if you're not wide fit, you'll be fine. Um, we're gonna keep to the same print for a little while. Obviously, I was obsessing over this print. I bought a few things in this print. So this is a midi skirt, and I did think this would be nice if it had a little split in, which it didn't, unfortunately. This is one of the items I got in a medium, and this, as you'll see in the cutaway, was a little bit snug around the bootay, around the bottom. This was £27. Um, I think everything's fairly reasonable, kind of like all middle of the road, and I think they are nice pieces and nice quality for the price, if I'm honest. Um, this is just kind of like a little bit standard. I feel like they could have done like a nice frill on the bottom, or like I said, a split up it or something. But again, it is gonna be super versatile. You can easily wear it with like little camis, little crops, anything you've got in your wardrobe. I'm assuming you probably have something that actually would go with it. I think they do do like mix and match pieces as well. So you could probably get a little top on there that matches if you like little cohorts. And um, yeah, this could be worn day, could be worn night, but you know, entirely up to you, but nice to have the versatility of the options. So when I got this one out of the bag, I was like, oh no, 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 no. 
but I really like it on. It felt like really autumn. This is actually my last summer haul. So the next haul you'll see on my channel will be transitioning to autumn. So there may be just a few little bits left, but not really any more summer hauls now. So this I felt like was bringing autumn in, but I really don't like it to look at. But on, I just really liked it. I think the fit was nice, the length was nice. Um, I did think that it could do with one more little button just here, but you could always tack that. Um, it surprised me. I think this would look great with a little pair of like like tan boots for winter. Um, sorry, for autumn. And yeah, maybe like a little tan hat or something, just like a little bit quirky. I love this like stretchy around the waist. I just think it's in a really easy day dress. Um, it's effortlessly classy and I just think dresses like this is why I love dresses and probably why I share so many dresses because you guys don't have to think too much about what to pair with them it's so easy like dresses play suits jumpsuits they're just the easiest things ever like if you don't get style if you don't know much about style but you want to look great it's so easy to just get a dress because you haven't got to worry about all that other stuff and then you literally just pick a tone out of it I then match that with the shoes in the bag. So for me with this, I'd probably pick a tan pair of shoes, pick it up on the brown, and then a little clutch bag. Or you, you could even go with white, you could even go with cream, nude, any sort of things. I don't think black would go, I think it would be a little bit too heavy, but yeah, anything along those lines is just super easy to do. So that's a nice little trick for you. So if you're not new to my channel, you will know that I have discovered a bit more color this year, and I also have discovered I love pastels and although this is a little bit dark, like a dark pastel, I still think it's really cute. I love the sleeves, I love the poofiness, even though I love a puffy sleeve. I just think this is super cute. This is a large and a fit great. Um, so it just ties around the waist and obviously that's great because you can adjust it to your waist which I always think is so good because it can pull you right in, you know, or wherever you are. If you're just eating a bowl of pasta, you can loosen it at that wheel room i love wrap dresses for that i just think they're just so great and comfy and i just really enjoy wearing a wrap dress um, and then it's obviously got this really cute frill underneath the bottom which i just absolutely love and you'll know if you're not new again i always say i love the way that the skirt falls on these like if it's like almost like a waterfall so it starts off higher and then comes down lower i just think it's super flattering on the legs really elongates the legs and this is a cute little day dress again you could definitely wear it for like a date night with a little pair of heels and a clutch but I think this is a little bit more of a day dress because the material is like almost linen-y and it has got a double line on the skirt and on the bust area but then the back bit is just single line so just bear in mind you probably need like a neutral bra or something with that. Um, next I've got this skirt which I've got to be honest I do think is a little bit cheap looking I'm not a fan. Oh sorry the purple dress was £40 and the yellowy one was £44. I'm forgetting because most most of the things actually arrive here don't have the prices on anymore so it's quite nice to actually have them on to tell you so this is 32 pound i feel like i feel like the quality isn't there for this i don't know if it's just because it's creased maybe if it had a good steam sal will be watching this my mother and she'll be like why is that so creased actually, i actually think this would look kind of cute with this top that i got on right now um but yeah this is going to be really versatile but i just think i just think i don't know the material is not doing it for me that's what it is, I'm a material snob and it's not doing it for me. I also think I maybe could have gone down the size, a little bit puffy. So I got this in a large, but it just, was, just wasn't just was doing anything from a shape. It was just sitting on my figure, not pulling me in at the waist, not going around anywhere. It just wasn't doing anything, but it is a really cute style. Perfect little summer skirt um, for your hauls, that kind of thing. But again, I think you'll get like cheaper versions than this, you know, in like places like Primark and stuff like that. So if you don't mind the money, go for that one but if you're more of like a bargain kind of gal which i kind of am then definitely head to like pre or something you can get something very similar yeah, i love this i really really love this i got the bag and i wasn't sure of the color like it wasn't the color i imagined it to be this is 21 pound and i got this in a medium but as you'll see it's quite wide like it's quite wide i would have thought i could probably get with actually with a small in this I like these kind of tops tucked in, so either tucked into like white high waisted shorts, white high waisted jeans, um, maybe just normal black jeans, maybe normal denim jeans. Like I think really, really pretty, like just perfect little date night top, but also could be worn in the day with like little shorts. Um, so very cute, very versatile, and it's got it's, it's nice. It's got adjustable straps because obviously that helps with the bust. But yeah, it is just wide for it being a medium, in my opinion. Okay, this is a sexy little number. 
Are you guys ready for this? I feel like this is a flamenco. This is from the RSPB edition, so this is obviously fancy. This is £46, which I don't think is unreasonable because it's super cute. This reminds me like an actually a better version. If you haven't seen my Zara haul, where I have a yellow dress with what felt like wings and I looked like Big Bird, you need to go and watch that next because this is like a classy version of that dress. So the actual style of the dress wasn't horrendous, I just think the fact that it was in yellow just reminded me of Big Bird. And if you don't know who Big Bird is, just Google it for one second or go and watch that video because I put a picture on the screen. Um, but yeah, just, if nothing else is for a giggle. But yeah, this is a classy, sexy date night version. Like if you are on the pull ladies, this is the dress. If you are going on a date and you want that man to pull for you, I think this is the dress. Honestly, this is an absolute dream. It was a large, the fit was great. Like for me personally, I actually think I would prefer if it was midi length. I'm kind of shifting away from the minis. I only really wear mini, maybe in a day, like a more of a day. And I wouldn't really go night out min mini anymore, I don't think. Don't hold me to that, you know. I'm still, I'm still under 30 and still holding my youth when I can. But yeah, this is just sexy and delicious and I really enjoyed that number. Then next I've got another little dress, which actually looks like a play suit, but it is a dress. And then it's got a little button detail just underneath the bust area. So the strap on these is really long and I wasn't really sure what to do with it. Like you could just tuck it behind and tie it in a bow, but I, one time I crisscrossed it. Then I put it in a bow here. I was just trying it all out for you guys. Let me know which way you like best. Um, and it's quite plungy, it's quite low. And I don't mind that because it is a day dress. I wouldn't really wear this in the evening, but you could, again, if you're just like literally want it for sp spontaneous evening um, and you're out wearing this, you could easily just pop on a pair of heels and go, you'd be good. Um, but it is more day because it's a very thin material. It's very, it'll be great somewhere hot. It will just keep you nice and cool. Um, and then it's got really cute little bow ties on the sleeves that you do yourself and a zip to get you in it. And it's just a really fine, like, pretty print. And again, I don't think it's anything that's going to go out of style. Super, like, classic and easy to wear, but just a pretty, pretty pastely lemon colour. And that is £25. So this is, like, for me, a staple piece for the wardrobe. Just a cute, pretty, white little cropped top with nice floaty sleeves. This I got in a medium, and the fit was really nice on this. Um, I have just put a stick on brow, and it's not ideal in the cutaway but you know give me a break this is 25 pounds which i think is actually really reasonable i've tried on a few recently um in river island which was similar and a lot higher in price so if you haven't seen my river island haul yet there's some really nice pieces in there but i prefer this top to the top from the river island haul um, and i just really it's maybe not as good quality though because it is actually thin and fine and you can actually it's almost see through and um, it's a little bit sheer but I mean, this is definitely more of a day one and I think the River Island one was more of an evening one. So just bearing that in mind and I guess the price obviously shows the difference. And then it's just got a nice stretchy back. I think this is just gonna be super cute with a little pair of like denim shorts for summer. If you've got any holidays or anything like that left. But again, if you haven't, it's gonna be in style next year. It's just completely like plain and classic. So it's all good. Talking about if you've got any holidays left, little pink bikini nets for you. This is actually really gorgeous. I absolutely, whoa. <laughs> I love the back. I love how like strappy it is and I love the gold detail. And um, the only thing for me is, as you can see when I'm holding like this, the white slightly comes through, like comes, it just slightly pokes out, which is a shame. Uh, it is really gorgeous. I think if it was pink all the way though, you wouldn't have that issue. So for me, that did let it down a little bit, but it, I think it was, yeah, it was quite reasonable. 16 pound for the top and then 14 pound for the bottom. So we're going like River Island prices, 30 pound for a bikini. Um, it's got the Lovie's little logo on the bottom, which I think is really cute. I think they could have just finished it off on the bottoms, maybe something on the ends, um, but they're just, ow. <laughs> they're just really simple tie bottoms and i just think tie bottoms are so flattering because you can obviously adjust them to your size um, and they don't make anything poke out too much also i've actually filmed uh, not an idtv 
I'm sorry, I have filmed a reel over on Instagram, which will probably be live now, um, doing a little body positivity post with that bikini. So if you are on Instagram, come over there, give it some love, and yeah, just let, let me know that you've come from over here as well, because I think that's really cool. And feel free to slide into my DMs. Love chatting with you all. It's actually really nice when I hear you guys that have come from here over there. Um, and I think it's a lot more personable over there. Like over here, I feel like we can't really have like a full blown combo in the comment section underneath this video. But like obviously over there, we can chat and like, yeah, I just love it. I think it's like the, the nice thing about social media is that you can actually, we can like get to know each other and all that cool stuff. Also, you can let me know what other videos you guys want to see because, you know, autumn is coming. Obviously, I'm going to do some autumn hauls, but I would love to hear other ideas of things that you guys want to see. And I know in your last... My last video, a lot of the comments said maybe some body positivity, maybe some self-love videos, that kind of thing. So that'll be really fun um, to share that kind of stuff with you guys. So I have a little cute pastel number. This is very cute. It's very like, almost like a nighty, very chill, but it is double lined, so it's nice quality, this one. This is 36 pound. I'm not over the moon with the print, like the daisy, but I do think it's still quite sexy just because of the style of the dress. I love the way that the bows tie up at the top, and you'll see in the cutaway that I'm just just showing you all the different ways you could possibly tie these, but this is my favourite with them probably at the bottom. Um, and then it's just got a zip to get you in at the back, and it's just kind of cute and sexy all in one, and then it's got a little slit up the leg as well, so just a super simple piece. This was slightly on the large side, but only slightly, so like maybe like bigger size 12s, you would be okay. I think I'm just bang with an average size 12, but you know. So it's kind of hard to tell with sizes these days, isn't it? Like what you actually are. It's just different, different most places. But actually, one thing I love about quiz, this, so if you are not subscribed, make sure you are subscribed, is that quiz does the perfect fit. So if it says size 12 and you're a size 12, it bloody fits. It's epic. I love it. I love quiz for that. And they're really up in their game. So yeah, make sure you are subscribed for this. Okay, so this next one's £41, which is a cute little white dress, obviously very classic, but again, perfect for day to night. Perfect with a little sun hat, little tan pair of sandals, perfect little with a little straw bag in the day, and then obviously dressed up in the night with a lovely pair of tan heels. I'm thinking tan is going to be the one, or nude. Um, and yeah, a little clutch again. This was a large, and it was again a little on the big side, but I don't know if like going down to a medium would be too small. It was a little big on the bust, but a bra probably could have sorted that out for me. Um, and it's just got a zip to get you into it at the side. The only thing that's a bit weird is where it gets you in, there's a, like a little extra hole. I'm not sure really what happened there and if it's meant to be like that, but it's a bit random. But it's really cute, the frill's really cute, it's just a standard like basic white dress. And it's a little bit longer, even though it's a midi, it's quite a long midi because of that extra frill on the bottom. So if you're tall, my tall girls, um, then you'll be fine with this one. So it's a nice little white dress without your bum popping out, you know? Okay, back to this fierce print that I shared with you. I was just obviously obsessing with it. Um, I couldn't decide what to get, so I got them all in this uh, print. Oh, oh. This one, for some reason, hasn't got a tag on, but I'm guessing it's around the 20 to 30 pound mark. It's just a strappy, basic spaghetti strap dress. It's a very classic style. This one was a little bit big, like again on the bust. It was just like sort of poking out. It wasn't really sitting quite right on the bust. Maybe adjusting the straps would have helped that a little bit. But yeah, if you're bigger bust, it probably would be more suited to you. Um, and it's got the adjustable straps, which is great. And then a zip at the side to get you in. Again, I think this is more of a day dress, but you could 100% wear it with a pair of heels. You know, like when you're on holiday and you don't want to take loads of stuff, this could definitely take you from day to night with a pair of heels in the evening. You could even wear this with sandals in the evening, so you don't even have to worry about heels. Wedges, maybe. I'm not really a wedge kind of girl, but you know, if you are, probably would look great with that. Okay, this top I absolutely love. Looking at it closely, I'm just like not loving the daisies, but actually on and like seeing it as an effect looking at it, I loved it. And I love the way it tied around the waist. It really sucked you in because of the material, it just looked great. Um, I love the puffy sleeves on this and I just love the shape and style of the top, I think it's great. It was a medium and it fit great and it was £31. I think that's the absolute top part of my, what I would actually pay for it is 31 pounds. I don't think I would ever go any higher. Um, I do really like it and it has got matching like scort, um, but I think the scort for me is a little bit short. So I will share it with you. Um, but personally, I think tall girls, 
unless, I don't know, I was say unless you're under a certain age, but I'm all about, you know, embrace and do whatever you want. Live what you want, wear what you want, be who you want. I don't really care. Like, we should just judge each other less. But for me, so I'm saying for me, I think these are a little bit short for me. Um, so what they are, like basically a pair of shorts and then they've got this wrap bit across the front which takes it into like a little skirt, which is super cute. They're a really cute frill and I probably would wear these on holiday, like maybe in the day. Um, and it, I mean, if you've got the legs, just wear it, don't even care, like just stop caring what people think, care less, do more what you want to do. Um, so they are really cute, but yeah, £31, side large. So it'll be 61 for the two, which I do actually think is quite pricey. And it has got a little zip up the side to get you in and the outer stretch at the back, which is nice. So again, money's no object, but I do think that's kind of pricey for a cohort, but it is really cute. What you're gonna do. So this top I'm gonna be honest, I'm not really impressed with. It's completely see-through, and as you'll see in the cutaway, I was just not styling it very well with that stick-on bra, but it was nude and I felt like maybe it would cover, but I actually think you're gonna have to wear like a body or a cami under this. You cannot wear it unless you're like gonna go black bra and just go all out like you can see my bra, you know? So just bear in mind what you want to do about that because it is not double lined, which is a shame. It's £31, so in my opinion, the shape of it and the style of it is not worth the money. I don't like the fit at all. I mean, it's medium, but look how wide it is. It's super wide, and it would look great tucked into things, but definitely isn't going to do anything for anyone's figure left out. I'm just going to say that. It's not going to look great. So, yeah, I like the puffy sleeves on it, and I don't really like anything else. <laughs> okay. So this top is actually very similar to what I'm wearing right now. As you can tell, this is obviously something I'm really enjoying at the moment. I actually really like this, but again, looking at it, I'm like, I'm not a huge fan, but on, I really like the shape of the top. And I do actually think the print is kind of cute. It's like, it's very weird colors for me. I mean, this is just really not me, but at the same time, I, I do love Ditsy Floral print. So I'm like, mm, it kind of is. And the shape definitely is. Um, so the top is £31 again, top end of what I would pay really for this kind of thing um, because of the quality and for, you know for how often you probably wear it. It would look really cute with like some mom jeans and some sandals or even some boots um, you know going into autumn but I don't really know for me like just looking at it like this I'm just like nah but on I did like it and you could easily wear it with like a nice white midi skirt or something like that um, and then some just easy heels for the evening. So. Could be versatile, but mm, I prefer this one, <laughs> in my opinion. So if you are not subscribed and you did enjoy today's video, definitely hit that subscribe button right now. It's a big fat red one that says subscribe. If you can't locate it, you can go into the description box and I've put a link there where you can click and it just subscribes you automatically as well. So, you know, I'm gonna help you guys out joining our Good Vibe Tribe. So thank you all for watching. Like I said, if you're not following me over on Instagram, I'd love it if you guys could pop over and just say hey over there. Also leave me a comment down below of your favorite item or any videos that you would like to see here on my channel. I have loved you being here today. Thank you all for watching. Let me know your first impression of Lovies. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Have a lovely day, evening, or night whenever you're watching this, and I'll see you in the next one. I upload videos Monday, Wednesday, and Sunday. Bye.